to be here to share my feelings towards this trip to you. First, I will show my deepest gratitude to all the considerations and kindness of NIU staff. It is their consideration to make this trip very pleasant for me. And uh, now, before going to America, I always wonder whether I should wear uh, stay clothes, uh, dress like a polar bear, <laughs> because of the bad weather here. But after I came arrived in America, I found all my worries, I, I'm worrying myself. Uh, the warm friendships, the warm experiences, even the word a warm heating system makes me very comfortable. <laughs> During the two weeks trip, uh, I went to the Chicago. I went to the Springfield. I hear the Phantom of Opera. I see the entertainment, uh, entertain both entertaining and educational museum. I want to talk about what I think about this trip. I found uh, my uh, what I harvest the most is I found what I really want to be and what I really want to do. This is easy to find, uh, even if when you are in the crowd or you are alone or you are on the moving bus. Uh, the things that occurs into your mind is the things that you desire most. Uh, being what uh, doing things what we want to do, you can stand for loneliness, you can stand for depression, you can stand for setbacks. Uh, no, whatever our dreams is, whether to become an ambitious president such as Lincoln to rise from humbles, or rather uh, we would like to become a happy housewife to spend a peaceful life with our husband or children, uh, we should have word in our mind. We should cherish the moment. We should be open-minded to embrace every day. Thank you. Thank you, all the NIU staff. Thank you, all the teachers accompanying me. Thank you, my best friend. Thank you.